Hello guys, how are you doing? I hope you are doing good. Welcome to our podcast today and today I want us to talk about how so many people have been talking about Megan when she was seen out in Montecito with her friend looking so gorgeous and happy. I love Megan and I love it when I see her happy and enjoying her life. I was looking at the post in social media and I was like, oh, freedom is sweet. And I'm happy for her that she is free to do anything she likes without caring about media or tabloids. That could not be possible in the UK, in that family where you can't do anything without the tabloids and the media interrupting. They don't even care about privacy at all. Harry and Meghan did the right thing getting away from that place. It was for their own good and safety. And now I am glad they are enjoying their freedom, the real state of independence where they can do what they like without any restriction by anyone. You know, I read somewhere about freedom and learned that there are three types of freedom. And I would like to share with you. The first one is freedom from. This is a freedom from the constraints of society. The second one is freedom to. And it's a freedom to do what we want to do. And third is freedom to be. And this is a freedom not just to do what we want but a freedom to be who we we were meant to be. And I can say this is totally true. And when I look at this lovely couple, the Sussexes have actually acquired all these three types of freedom and now they are totally free. They are enjoying, they are happy. A happiness they never had before when they were still in that family. Let me explain to you the freedom from the constraints of the society. Look at that British Royal Society, the constraints in the name of protocol. They even accused Meghan of breaking protocol by tying her hair in a messy bun. And when Kate Middleton copied her by tying her hair the same way, Nothing was said about that, like that was not breaking the protocol. And the freedom to do what we want to do. Megan could not do what she wanted to do in that family. The Duchess of Sussex had been living a free life before coming to that family, and Prince Harry admired that of her. But when she came to that family, It was like a bondage. You cannot do this. You should do this this way. Fine. Megan was willing to learn because she had accepted the family where her lovely husband came from and was respectfully willing to learn their traditions so they can live happily. But even after doing what she was required to do, It was never enough for them and started criticizing everything she did. Imagine being in a position where you can't do what you want to do and even when you do what people want you to do, they still complain about you. Isn't that a bondage? Duchess Megan is a dreamer, a freestyler and yes, She still observes law and protocol, especially those that make sense. She needed that freedom to do what she wants to do so much, and I'm happy she got it. And lastly, the freedom to be who we were meant to be. I can say Prince Harry was born a real king, not the kinghood given to to him through coronation and crowning but the good name he gets through what he loves doing to people 
He has always loved doing charity work and stepped in to support his mother's charities. The only sacrifice he knows is giving his time and funds to support others for their benefits. To uplift others and I'm happy he found the perfect match for himself who is Duchess Megan. For me, I think finding Megan was like to complete the compass if there's something like that because together they could find their direction. They have finally found their north. Prince Harry is a very good man and like his brother William who was more than willing to sacrifice his only brother only to build himself a name for kingship with the help of his father Charles and I'm sure Camilla and Kate were there to keep the fire burning. Prince Harry could not be who he was meant to be in that family and by breaking free he has even discovered a lot about himself and he is thriving. The real king and queen are now living a comfortable, free and happy life. This is really lovely. Even their love is growing more and more stronger. Truly, in freedom, we can thrive. I am glad that Prince Harry has been able to freely express his love to his dear wife and that just Meghan has been able to freely support her loving husband. And they really, really look wonderful. From Prince Harry admiring Frido to finally leaving it, he is truly a happy man now, and Megan is happy to be free again, so let her slay. Yes, see how she exudes health and happiness. Look at that big, beautiful smile on her face. She is living her best life, and I'm so happy for her. And so guys, this is the end of our podcast today. Thank you so much for your time. And don't forget to leave a comment down below. And see you in our next podcast.